Dr. David Samadhi, top robotic prostatectomy surgeon, knows a thing or two about prostates. In fact, he successfully removed over 4,000 of them from men with prostate cancer. But cancer isn't the only prostate problem out there. Benign prostatic hyperplasia is an overgrowth of prostate cells, causing an enlarged prostate gland. Dr. Samadhi is also a leader in BPH surgery, performing significantly more PVP prostate surgeries each year than most urologists. BPH is not cancerous and does not cause cancer, but the symptoms of BPH and the propensity for men to develop it are strikingly similar to prostate cancer. The incidence of BPH seems to follow right along with a man's age. An enlarged prostate occurs in about 50% of men by age 50 and 80% of men by age 80. BPH symptoms start off as mild nuisances, but gradually progress as the condition worsens. Referred to as lower urinary tract symptoms, they may include frequent urination, slow flow, or a urine stream that's weak, dribbling or leaking after urination, erectile dysfunction or pain during orgasm, or obvious problems like blood in the urine or pain and burning sensations after urination. Men drag their feet to the doctor, acknowledges Dr. Samadhi, but these symptoms can't be ignored. In some cases, they're a signal of prostate cancer, but men don't have to panic. BPH and prostate cancer are not one and the same. BPH is very common and surgical treatment works. BPH is confirmed through urinalysis, PSA blood testing, and rectal exam. Dr. David Samadhi is vice chairman at the Department of Urology and chief of robotics and minimally invasive surgery at the Mount Sinai Medical Center in New York, where he leads the nation in robotic prostate cancer surgery and BPH surgery.